In this video, we're going to discuss how pricing works within the Gala map. When you're submitting a task to the network, there are several factors that go into determining the estimated price that you will pay for your render. The formula for determining the price of a task is subtask total times GNT per hour times subtask timeout threshold in hourly increments. So for example, if you set a task with five subtasks, and you set your GNT per hour to 0.5 GNT per hour, and you set a 30 minute subtask timeout, that's going to equal 1.25 GNT. So that's five times 0.5 times 30 divided by 60. If your settings result in a number with a long decimal, Gollum will round to the nearest hundredth. If you choose three subtasks at 0.5 GNT per hour, and a 12 minute and 30 second subtask timeout, then your price will be 0.31 GNT. Since pricing is directly tied to your subtask timeouts, it's important to test your typical workflow a few times before submitting tasks to the mainnet network. This way you can determine the best settings for the lowest price. As a starting point, we recommend setting your GNT per hour somewhere around 20 cents USD worth of GNT. That's a good starting point for the network and for the marketplace. Setting a lower price for your task will result in a slower but cheaper computation. On the other hand, setting a higher price for your task will result in a faster and more expensive computation. Once you've set the desired price for your task and all other settings are to your liking, you can hit the Start Task button and wait for your task to be computed. If you have any other questions, please refer to the documentation that we have linked in the description of this video.